Hello everyone and welcome to my latest video. Today I'm going to show you how to connect your StreamYard live streaming software to your Instagram Live so that you can live stream via your StreamYard software into your Instagram Live. Now this is a super quick tutorial for those of you who are already using StreamYard. So as you can see from the screen, I'm already in my StreamYard dashboard. And what I wanna do, first of all, is add Instagram as a destination. So all you have to do is come here to the destinations option and then click add a destination. So as you can see, there is the option for Instagram Live. So go ahead and click that and then add in your Instagram username. And then click add Instagram live. Your Instagram account was connected, you're all set. So there's a few things you need to do in Instagram before you can go live. So let's go over to our Instagram account. Whilst I connect that, why don't you hit the subscribe button underneath this video and click that you like it so that you can come back for more. Don't forget also, if you think that one of your colleagues or friends might enjoy this video, smash that share button and share it with them. Okay, so here we are on my Instagram account. The best thing to do is come down to your profile so that you know that you're on your account and this is you. Okay, so step one, click the create option and click live video. So here you can add your title. Now you can choose your audience. You can either choose public or practice. For the purpose of this video, I'm gonna just choose practice, but you will probably do public. Click next. Now we have to copy this stream key and then hop back to StreamYard. So now what we want to do is we want to create the stream inside of StreamYard. So click create and go to live stream. Now choose your destination, which is Instagram, and add your title. Now we need to add the stream key that we just copied from Instagram into that area and click create live stream. Now it's not gonna go live yet, so don't panic. We're just entering the studio where you can get yourself set up. So as you already use StreamYard, you'll know that your camera and your mic are already connected. Just in case you don't, then go to the settings option and you can alter your camera and your audio. When you're done, click the cross. Okay, you've got your display name, jump on into the studio. Now, as usual, add yourself to the stage and you're all set to go. Now we have to go live here and then hop over to Instagram. Now, one thing I'd like to show you, first of all, is that when you are going live on Instagram, you will have the audio from your Instagram coming out. Now, because you have to keep your Instagram open, you do need to mute this tab because when you are in your studio talking, you are gonna have a delay that you'll hear from your Instagram tab. Now all you have to do is come up to the Instagram tab and mute it. So I right click on my mouse and I'm using a Mac and I click mute site. Now what this will do, it will mute the Instagram site so that when you go live on your StreamYard, you're not going to have that echo in here. Right, so we're ready to go. So all we need to do in StreamYard is click the go live button and that's going to send it's through to Instagram and we'll see the preview come through in just a second. It can take a little bit of time and I suppose it depends on your connection. There we are. We're inside of the live area inside your Instagram live now. And as you can see, the video is coming through. You won't hear the audio on here because I've muted the tab, remember? So you will hear the audio when you go live in here. Then all you have to do is click the go live option on your Instagram account. And I would recommend that you stay on this tab whilst you're answering your comments. However, you can pop over to your studio if you want to add in any of your banners to show on your screen and any overlays or screen shares that you have. When you go over to Instagram, there will be a little delay with what you do on your StreamYard studio, but there you see it's already in there. When you want to stop, just click end live video in your Instagram account, jump over to your StreamYard studio, 
It sometimes shows you straight away, but again, there is a little bit of a delay coming back. So you will see an error come up with your live or just go ahead and click end stream and you will be able to end the stream inside your StreamYard studio. And that's it. That's all you have to do to live stream from your StreamYard studio to go straight into your Instagram live. So you don't have to use your mobile anymore if you don't want to. You can go live from your desktop using your StreamYard studio. It will connect it automatically between the two. So that was a super quick tutorial. My name's Anita Wong. Don't forget to give me the thumbs up if you've liked this video. If you want to come back for more, smash the subscribe button. And of course, share this video with any of your colleagues or friends that might want to know how to go live on Instagram using StreamYard. Thanks very much, and I will see you in the next video.